Good afternoon, and welcome to Mary High School's production of the Broadway hit musical, Hairspray. We would like to thank you all for your overwhelming support and encouragement of the Broadway production. Please join us in welcoming Mary High School's Broadway hit musical, Hairspray. For more information on upcoming productions by Mary High School Theater Department, you can visit Mary High School's website at www.bluedevilltheater.com. Please take a moment to silence your cell phones. There will be no flash photography or videography allowed during this production. Thank you, and enjoy the show.
But she can't dance. Plastic little spastic. Oh no, I'm gonna kill myself. Look! She's wearing Wayne Clarkin's council ring. Hey gang, don't forget to watch Mom and Me next Thursday on Mother Daughter Day. And I want to be your Miss Teenage Hairspray. So remember, a vote for me for me is a vote for me. <laughs> Our very own fun-loving and free-living friend will be taking a leave of absence from the show. How long will you be gone, Brenda? Just nine months. <laughs> <laughs> so we're sitting here at an opening for a girl who's just as kind-loving, but maybe not as free-willing. Uh, what if you want to ask you to get down? Cut school tomorrow. Come down to station WZZT to audition. for anything. There's no cutting class in this house. But Mrs. Turn Black! Penny, go tell your mother that she wants you. Oh, she does? Oh, I better hurry! My Mrs. Turn Black! Oh, rush hour traffic! Hey, hiya, lady! Sit down. Hey, you know, since I got that shipment of exploding bubblegum, business downstairs is really booming! So how are my two funny honeys? <laughs> Stop it, Wilder, you're the funny one. Daddy, tomorrow I'm auditioning to dance on a TV show. Hey, stop right there, young lady. No one is auditioning for anything. Look at her, all hair redded up like a teenage Jezebel. Oh, Ma, you are so 50. Even our first lady, Jackie B. Kennedy, wraps her hair. Well, you ain't no first lady there, are you? No, you're a hair hopper, that's what she is. Wilbur, come here. Talk to Tracy. People like her, like us, the only person on television to be laughed at. So Tracy, this TV thing, do you really want it? It's my dream, Daddy. Then you go for it. This is America, babe. You gotta think big to be big. Now, being big is not the problem, Wilbur. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, honey, when I was your age, my parents begged me to join the circus. But I said, no, that's what you want. And I've got dreams of my own. In fact, I dreamt of owning a, a chain of joke shops worldwide. So, okay, I've only got one. But when I figure out how to keep the air from leaking out of my sofa-sized whoopee cushion, I'm going to make the noise heard around the world. <laughs> Honey, you follow your dreams. I'm heading down to the Hardy Hard Hut and grab an orange crush. I got my dream, and I love it. Oh, damn. <laughs> <We're gonna stop>. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Daddy. Uh, no, come back here, young lady. Where do you think you're going? I got piles of laundry, and my doy pills wearing out. But, Ma, I want to be famous. Oh, you want to be famous? Learn how to take blood out of car upholstery. There's a skill you can take right to the bank. You think I always wanted to be here on and amend in other people's clothing? No! I wanted to design them! I wanted to be the biggest thing in Brazier's! Well, be careful what you wish for, so start folding. <laughs> Occidental laundry. Will you be ready? I sure hope not. Don't contradict me. Don't disobey me. Don't even think about going to that audition. Please. No. Mother. Stop. Stop, Stop telling me what to do. Don't. Don't. Don't treat me like a child of two. No.
by a brand new council member, Miss Tracy Dermlatch. Tracy and I in our own living room. <laughs> you know, I think I've seen her here before. <laughs> My little girl, regular, at last. Hi, Tracy, it's me, can I? Penny, she can't hear you. Hi, Tracy! <laughs> Hello? Oh, yes, this is the turn that family residence. No, I'm not the father. So let's wave a wistful bye-bye to Brenda. Bye, bye to Brenda. See you next year. <laughs> And I'm bringing the newest member of our council, Miss Tracy Turnblad! Tell us after all, Corny, tell me about yourself, Tracy. Well, I go to Patterson Park High, I watch your show, and I do absolutely nothing else! But someday, I hope to be the first woman president of the world! Poor Rockhead, you gotta think big and be big! And if you were president, what would your first official act be? Well, I'd make every day Negro Day! Ah! <laughs> well, our reason like tomorrow is that is Tracy. What do you say? Kids looks like we have a hot new candidate for Miss Teenage Hairspray. No! Uh, she can't do Miss Hairspray. She's the before the vegetable diet ad, and I'm the after, and after I'm like, hey! Remember, what a comedian. <laughs> so, Tracy, tell us true. How would you like Lake Walker to sing a song just for you? No! Thank you. 
Big Bot Hustle Negro Day every day. Oh, that was funny. That chubby communist girl yes. is kissing on the mouth with possibly parted lips. I, never I can mouth. assure you, controversy is not what Ultra Clutch wishes to promote. No, no, no. Negroes no. and chubby girls buy hairspray too, Mr. Spritzer. Mrs. Von Tussle, what do you plan on doing about this? I plan to start. <laughs> by 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 firing him. You can't fire Corny Collins tonight. Corny Collins. Why not? They do it all the time. Oh, Lassie! Woof! <laughs> Mr. Spritzer, in order to keep your audience, you've got to keep up for the time. The show is fine the way it is. Bringing Tracy onto the show is just the beginning. I have terrific ideas for updating the show. I'm getting another one of my sick headaches. Is there somewhere in this place where I can lie down? There's a bed in my office. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you have ideas, do you? And putting this no talent call me on the show is one of them? Damn right, Velma. It's time we start putting the kids on the show who look like the kids that watch the show. Not while well, I'm producing it! Well, I think it might be time to change that, too. <laughs> Are you threatening me, Cullens? Oh, you know me, Velma. Uh, <laughs> on the other hand, I could always take the show to Channel 11. <laughs> Oh my god, that snake that sings, he's a puppet, but I hold the purse and the strings. God, I knew Negro Day would bring chaos and change. Now he's pushing this pinko who might give us 